I found the easiest way to create digital wall art with AI. This is like follow up video of my previous one that I showed how to use multiple artboards in Kito. I played a little bit and I found very easy way to create digital wall art and you can use those files afterwards for printables or you can put them on physical products. So with that being said, let's get straight to the video. Just quick note, we're going to create five different sizes and if you don't know how to size your digital arts, let me show you. You can watch my playlist printable wall arts. Let me open this playlist. You can see I created in-depth videos about sizes, DPI and everything about how to size your uh, digital wall arts. And also here you can watch this video as well, how to create digital wall art with AI. And after that, how to prepare this AI to sell in Etsy. So let's go straight to Kito. We are on main page. Let's open new project. There you go. I'm going to create first of all 11 by 14 inches size. Let's move this in inches. 11 by 14. 300 dpi and hit create. There you go. We've got our file. After that I will upload this image with the sizes. We've got our image. Let me drag this when we click on the artboard here we can clip content and we can see this file so we've got 11 bar by 14 ratio after that we need 2 by 3 ratio we're going to create only the biggest sizes that we offer 24 by uh, 36 inches so so here on your top left just press this icon and draw a file so let's size this one this one is going to be 24 by 36 inches 24 by 36 done let's make everything smaller so is it in inches yes 24 by 36 inches next one is going to be 18 by 24 hit press here draw another board 18 by 24 done the other one is 16 by 20 we can also just click on the artboard hold out and drag the file or we can click on the file control c control v and we're going to copy this one so this one is going to be 16 by 20 16 by 20 and the last one let's move this here we're going to rearrange everything to be easy after that 16 by 24 so this is supposed to be 16 by 20 16 by 20 done this one is 18 by 24 this one is 24 by 36 this one is supposed to be 11 by 14 just make sure you've got the right sizes and the last one is uh, international paper size or uh, is going to be a1 format which is 23.4 by 33.1 so this one is going to be 23.4 by 33.1 done okay so let's double check everything let's make this more there you go okay this one is the ISO file this one is 11, 11 by 14 this one is 16 by 20 this one is 24 by 36 and this one is 18 by 24. So now I'm going to create AI image with Kito AI. Now we need to click on this icon on our bottom left. Kito AI is going to open this window. And here we can write our prompt. But I asked ChatGPT, let me show you, to write me 10 prompts. You can see here 
Can you write me 10 image prompts for AI designs that includes bees and flowers? And after that, I asked him to include butterflies and he wrote another 10. Let's say the first one, garden scene with bees. Let's try the first one and we see. Paste here. Click generate image. It's gonna cost me two credits. I uh, don't have credits at the moment, but I've got extra credits. Let's wait a few more seconds and it's going to create the image. And I will show you the credits. There is a few ways to earn credits. Just let's see what we're going to have. So we've got this image and now I can upscale this image. It's gonna cost me one credit. Let's upscale this image. It's going to be even high resolution, even though this image is, is very good. There you go, it's ready. Now I can create our files. So it's a little bit dif difficult to make all the, the different sizes uh, the same, but we're going to, to try to do our best to be at least close to each other. Let's make this a little bit bigger. No, it's too big. Okay, I think this one is good. Press out, drag the file, just make this file smaller. And from here we can so we can align this on our left and on the middle. This one on the left and middle. So out, drag the file, make this file smaller. Uh, let's make it a little bit bigger. I think it's okay. Control C, Control V. We've got another file. I think this way is so easy because we've got our size boards done. Control C, Control V. And we need to do the last one. Okay. Perfect. So let's name our files. This one is a A1 file. Just double click on artboard, A1. This one is 11 by 14, 11 by 14. This one is 24 by 36, double click, 24 by 36. This one is 18 by 24, 18 by 24. There you go, and the last one 16 by 20, double click 16 by 20, done. Okay, we've got our files. This it doesn't work for some reason, but it's it's done perfect. Okay, so make it a little bit bigger to see if everything is all right. Okay, perfect. Now we need to download our files. So we're going on our download button. We can download PNGs, JPEG files. So if you want to sell this as printable wall arts, the most of the sellers offer JPEG files, but you can offer all the files that you can download from here. Let's download JPEG files. We can download all artboards in the same time. Let's check if everything is okay. JPEG files, all artboards. 300 dpi just press download oh something gets wrong let's refresh this window and i'll try to do this again let's try it again and if it doesn't work i'll try to download the images one by one so let's go on jpeg files everything is perfect all artboards download same issue Okay, probably because this is the new feature, they have, they are facing some issues, but probably they will fix this for, let's say, 24 hours, I don't know. But let's try to download the images one by one. And let's refresh this window. JPEG files. Let's try the first one, 11 by 14. Just check because you can see here now it's not correct numbers 11 by 14 now it's okay download yeah it's working okay let's download all of them so the next one 24 by 36 nope 
go back 24 by 36 done download the image okay let's go to the next one 18 by 24 18 by 24 download done the next one 16 by 20 16 by 20 done and the last one a1 so let's check the sizes 23.4 23.4 jpeg it fits perfectly okay download this one done let's check our files there you go let's check the sizes they're in pixel size 300 dpi which means for any inch we need three, 300 pixels to be high quality you can check this easily on 11 by 14 you can see it's perfect so we've got our images for our digital products we can sell this on Etsy and let's check them for physical products in Printify so go on Printify catalog type canvas done bestseller let's start designing go to our files let's drag which one 11 by 14 let's try the biggest one just wait to upload it and we need to find the correct size to see if it works perfectly but i think everything is going to be perfect because the the, the resolution is i think is perfect few more seconds and it's going to be done come on and after that actually during this period let me show you how to earn how to earn AI credits here you can see the the subscription plans you can sign up for free and check any features and when you go here you can see earn credits let's he press here and it's open another window and here you can see how you can earn even more credits if you invite friends for any any friend you can receive 100 credits if you send a post a video testimonial you can get 200 credits and so on you can check this page let's check if everything is done on printify there you go so let's select variants we need 24 by 36 24 by 36 this one let's perfect let's close variants here you can see it's high resolution 300 dpi and from here you can check print on sites and print mirror sites you can test both i think it doesn't matter and from here you can preview the the file how it looks there you go this is how we look and this is picture on the on the site you can see how it's wrapped on the site i think this one is very 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 good so with that being said Thanks a lot for watching everybody, I really hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please consider subscribing, that just really helps me to keep these videos coming regularly, and as always, I see you in the next one.